They pay lip service to what my second coming means. Wednesday, February 12, 2014 at 11 p.m. My dearly beloved daughter, how long did man think that I would wait before communicating with him again before my second coming? Did he think that I would do this the year before? The month before? The week before? Or did he believe that I would not warn him at all? Before my birth, the world was promised a Messiah. My father spoke through the prophets, so that humanity would be given hope, wisdom and the grace to accept the word of God, so that they would be ready for my arrival. Did they listen? Many did and prepared for my time. Sadly, when I was born they were not ready. Then John the Baptist gave them the word and warned them to prepare. Were they ready? No, for they did not believe him. And yet many were saved, because through my death on the cross, caused by their rejection of me, I redeemed them in the eyes of my Father. So many fought against my mission then and yet so many followed me. Now the world is being prepared again because of the love of my Father for all his children. This time, it will be more difficult. For all their knowledge of me, they will still refuse to accept that God is intervening and preparing them through his prophet. The further away they remove themselves from God, the less they know of my promise. They pay lip service to what my second coming means, because many of them really do not know anything about it at all. This time they will be left with little option but to see the signs, which they will have to bear witness to, for I will reveal all. When I say something will happen and when it does, they will still deny that the prophecy came from the words uttered by my lips. When they see the earth twist, shake and other punishments poured down upon them, they will still argue that there is a scientific reason for it. When the great apostasy engulfs the world and crushes Christianity, in favor of paganism, will they say that this is a good thing? The answer is yes. So, as my presence becomes less revered by so many, what chance does the world stand against Satan? This is why my father prepares you now, for he never gives up when preparing his children for his great mercy. The preparation of humanity will continue and the world will be given the truth, in order to save man from the final destruction. My time is close and the whole of humanity must allocate the time needed to prepare their souls. Time must never be squandered when you are preparing to welcome me. You must never dismiss the word given to a prophet of God. If you do, you slap me, your Jesus, in the face. Your beloved Savior. Jesus Christ.